$125 worth of product for $13. Let me show you how. Hello, welcome back. Thank you for joining. Guys, this is, <laughs> this is the third time that I've recorded this video, just so you know. So if I forget something, I will come back to it. I promise it is recorded. So let's get into this. <laughs> We went to Walgreens this morning and we did four different transactions. So let's just jump into it. Let's just get it. The crest is the first thing that I did. I bought four, four of these crests. They are on promotion. Buy three of them, get a $5 register reward. But I bought four of them because I had a digital coupon for $8.50 off four. So, I went ahead and got four of those, and then I added that with the Snuggle. It was on sale for $3.49. We had a digital coupon for $1.50 off. Then I got the Dove Body Wash. I got two of them. They were on sale for $8 each, making that $16. Um, we also had a coupon for that, $4 off two. So, what we did, um, we spent $22.84, but that was because my $8.50 coupon did not come off. Ugh, so frustrating when that happens, but I, I had to have it on a couple transactions, of course. So I called customer service when I got home and she made it all right because she saw that I had them clipped already. So not a problem, it's just another step, a little more frustrating, but that's okay. We then spent $14.34. Each time you go to Walgreens and you are a rewards member, you get a little bit of Walgreens cash back. So for this one, I had 26 cents. So I'm gonna add that into the total because that's what I got back in Walgreens cash. So $14.08 is what I paid for this transaction. But I got $6 back on Ibotta because these were on there you get $3 for each one that you buy. There was a limit of five on there. So obviously I bought two of them, so I got $6 back, making that total transaction $8.08. But I was missing two of my register rewards. They, they just didn't print, I don't know why. And I had to submit a form to the Catalina Company, that's the machine that prints the register rewards, because the Walgreens customer service, she said that they don't do anything with that. So I've never done that before. Hopefully I get those back because that happened on another one. Um, and that's $10 on that one transaction. If we would have got that back, it would have been uh, free and like a $2 money maker. So a little disappointing, but that's okay. That's all right, we're doing great. Um, next transaction that we did we did, I did the two Old Spice. These were two for $12 and I had a $3 off two coupon. And plus my husband loves these, you, you guys know that. Dawn, I did the Dawn dish soap. I was gonna do the Febreze small spaces, like room air freshener, but they were out at my store. So I had to like re-math everything because I needed another P&G product that wasn't too expensive. Plus this had a, let's see, what was it? A dollar coupon on the app. So I was like, okay, that kind of evens out a little bit. Plus I love Dawn dish soap. I don't know about you guys, it works perfect. I also got these two Colgate toothpastes. They were $3.99 each, so $7.98. We had a three off two digital coupon that I clipped. Then you get $4 back in Walgreens cash, making that completely free. So these are wonderful. They come around, uh, I wanna say about every week or so, a couple weeks, these and the Oral-B toothbrushes that you can get them for completely free. Does not cost you anything. Last one was the Dollar Shave Club. I got the shaving cream for $6.99. I had a one time coupon. It was $5 off one, so $1.99. I think that was pretty nice. So for that total, of course my Five dollars didn't come off of the shave club. So yeah, that's why I had to call again. So that um, minus the four dollars and 25 cents, remember the 25 cents you get every time? Okay. Cents in Walgreens cash. So I paid 12.28 out of pocket. Swipe my card, 12.28. But I 
did give back the $5 registry reward like I was supposed to, but I was missing the two other registry rewards. So there's $20 in total that I didn't get. Hopefully those come back, uh, but if not, if not, it's fine. We live and learn, but they should print. I feel like if they don't print, then they should like give you Walgreens cash in the store or something. Maybe I should try that. We'll, we'll see. Um, then the fun surprise, I checked coupon.com. Guys, let's talk about these rebate apps for a second. When you go to Ibotta or coupons.com or Shopkit or Swagbucks, I mean, they're all linked below if you want to check them out, you can find some pretty awesome things. I did not expect it, and I usually check it after every receipt, but the coupons.com app gave me $3 for the two Colgate. Did not think that, so I got three extra dollars. So in total, I paid $9.23 for that total transaction, okay? Nine twenty-three, not bad. Again, missing my register rewards, but that's okay. <laughs> All right, third transaction. It was the Venus. We did this last time. Um, it was eleven dollars for the razor, fifteen for the refills. But obviously, we didn't have the same coupons that we had last time. Once you use your coupons, they leave, so they weren't as good. But I did have other ones, so I had a four dollar and a three dollar coupon. Of course, my three dollar digital did not come off. <laughs> So that's one of the ones that she made right for me. But these were on promotion for you spent $25 in Venus or Gillette and you get $10 in Walgreens cash. So I was like, okay, let's do this deal. So after both of those, so again, $10 and 26 cents then Walgreens cash that I got back, I paid $10 and 56 cents. And guess what guys? I got my register rewards back. So I got the personal care one and the P&G one back. So awesome, love that. If you are a couponer and you count that into your total like most people do, that would mean it was just 56 cents for that whole transaction. If you don't wanna count them in, that's completely fine. I'm kind of in that category because you, you're not using these in this transaction. Yes, you're getting it back, but you're gonna use them in another transaction. That's why in I, Remember how I told you I have made this video three times? In the, in the first two transactions, I used a $5 store register reward to lower that out of pocket. It is all in the printable breakdown below, guys. So if I'm not making sense, please, please just open that up, read it through. You'll see everything that I did. So you can do it too if you'd like. So we got these two back. Whoop. And then we moved on to the last transaction, which also went perfectly, exactly how I wanted it to, the as I planned it to, I guess I should say. <laughs> the two uh, Downy Liquid and the two Downy Unstoppables and the Palm Olive I did in one transaction. The uh, Laundry Care, they were four for $9. So we kind of did that last time, but I had bought seven of them because I wanted to be above 15. This time I had store register rewards that were going to expire today that I had to use. So I went ahead and I just got four of them. And then the Palm Olive, just so I could get above that $10, plus I had a, let's see, a dollar, a dollar coupon for the Palm Olive. So I got above $10 and then I used two register rewards. I used one store one and one manufacturer one, because you can do that. Just one store one per each one, which messed me up, but we fixed it. And then of course the dollar, came off, making this total just 94 cents. 94 cents for that entire transaction. Plus, coupons.com, they had 50 cents off for the Palm Olive. So I only paid 44 cents for that transaction. So I think the last two made up for the first two because they were just a hot mess. So in total, product money worth was 99.94 not including tax. Since tax in every state is different, I didn't include that. But if you are gonna include it, it was about $105 worth of product, which I spent out of pocket $28.31. So that alone, I think is a great, great deal. I mean, that's like what, 80% off? Close to it, 70% off. But then I got the 15 register rewards back so that would be $13.31. That's not even including the $20 in registered rewards that I did not get. If 
we would count those. We would say this was free in a $6.69 money maker. But like I said, I don't really like doing that. I think that's a little confusing. Um, but again, completely up to you, whatever you and your family wanna do, completely fine. If you guys have questions, please let me know down in the comments. Please like and subscribe so you can see the next video. Next one's gonna be Walmart because that's what I'm gonna do, Walgreens and Walmart. If you guys need anything else, um, have any questions on the rebate apps, I'm gonna do a few videos explaining those and trying to get it, you know, just a little tutorial on how to use them and which way is the best way. I know people can use them. Again, however you want, it's your life. You can do whatever you want. But if you want some help, just let me know. Um, thank you so much for being here. Bye-bye.